Hi there, my name is Richard McMunn from the interview training website, passmyinterview.com. And in this tutorial, I will teach you how to pass a payroll interview. So it does not matter whether you are applying to become a payroll officer, a payroll manager, a payroll specialist or a payroll administrator. Make sure you stay tuned because I will help you to pass your interview. And to achieve that goal, this is what I will cover. I will give you a list of payroll interview questions that I strongly recommend you prepare for. And these questions are suitable for all payroll job roles. I will then give you example answers to difficult payroll interview questions to help you succeed. I will also give you some really good tips on how you can stand out during your payroll interview. And I will also tell you how you can access further resources, including these slides, to help you succeed. So let's get into the first payroll interview question. And that is going to be tell me about yourself. Now, the key to answering this first payroll interview question with confidence is to talk about the skills and qualities you have that are a match for the job description. So here's a great example answer to assist you. Tell me about yourself. Here we go. I am a confident focused and fast working employee who understands how important attention to detail is working in payroll. Now, over the years, I have gained experience in a variety of different positions and I've undertaken various training courses that I believe make me the ideal candidate for this position based on the requirements of the job description. I have good IT and Microsoft Office application skills. I am a strong communicator. I have exceptional levels of accuracy and attention to detail, and I am a good solid team worker. I am also highly effective with time management. I can work to strict deadlines. I will always maintain workplace confidentiality, and I will ensure my work is conducted to a very high standard in line with the organization's values. Now, if you hire me in this position, I feel confident you will be getting someone who can make a positive and long lasting contribution to the payroll team. That is a brilliant answer to that first payroll interview question. Tell me about yourself. Now, you can either pause the video if you want to and take a note of the questions and answers as we work through them. Or if you want to wait, I will tell you soon where you can download my full set of 23 payroll interview questions and top scoring answers including the ones we are covering today during this presentation. So here's the next question I want you to prepare for. Why do you want to work in payroll? Now, this interview question is clearly assessing your motivations for wanting to work in payroll. Now, payroll is a job that requires a unique set of skills and qualities, including attention to detail, accuracy and strong communication capabilities. So here's another great answer to help you. Why do you want to work in payroll? I want to work in payroll because it is the type of work that I find interesting and I enjoy working in a position where I have the responsibility for ensuring things are consistently carried out to a high standard. Now, payroll is a very important part of an organization's operations and I like the fact the work brings you in contact with people from throughout the organization. I want a role where I am responsible for lots of different things and where my organisational and planning capabilities are really put to good use. Payroll is a natural fit for my own skills and qualities and it is a job I have no doubt I will be doing for many years to come. So that's a brilliant answer. It shows you're motivated to work in payroll. Now, don't go anywhere because I still have more questions and answers to give you. But when you're ready, if you want to click that link in the top right hand corner of the video, it will take you through to my website, passmyinterview.com, and you can download my full set of 23 payroll interview questions and top scoring answers, including the ones we are covering today during this presentation. Here's the next question I recommend you prepare for. What do you expect to be doing on a day-to-day -day basis in this payroll position? Now, this question comes up often during payroll interviews, and it is assessing whether you have read the job description. Now, I've done the hard work for you, and here is my example answer to assist you. What do you expect to be doing on a day-to-day -day basis in this payroll position? Here we go. I will have lots of duties and responsibilities, and having studied the job description, these include checking and monitoring employees' hours worked during any given payroll time period, 
calculating pay on a bi-weekly, four-weekly or monthly basis, depending on the organisation's reimbursement time periods, calculating tax payments and ensuring all staff have the applicable tax codes for their individual circumstances. I will also be required to ensure all staff are paid on time and they receive accurate pay slips. Other duties include setting up pension contributions for all staff, making sure all tax and national insurance contributions are paid, calculating overtime and applicable pay, managing pay situations such as sick leave, annual leave, unpaid leave, maternity leave and other relevant situations and also setting up pay for new members of staff as and when they join the organisation. I will also be required to assist in the creation of new payroll practices, policies and procedures and to liaise with employees to answer any questions or queries they may have in respect of their pay or their tax contributions. So that's a really good answer. It shows that you have studied the job description and you have a thorough understanding of what you will be required to do on a day-to-day -day basis in the payroll job that you are applying for. Here's the next question I strongly recommend you prepare for. Why do you want to work for our company in this payroll position? Now again, this question is guaranteed to come up during your payroll job interview. In your response, be positive about their organisation and state that you plan to stay working for them for a long period of time if you are successful. So here's another great answer to help you. Why do you want to work for our company in this payroll position? Here we go. Before applying for this payroll job, I spent time researching your company to make sure it was somewhere I would want to stay working at for a long period of time. Now, everything I researched pointed to the fact you are a company of very high standards, you are a company that has strong workplace values, and you are a company that supports its staff to be the best they possibly can be in their job roles. Now, I am looking for long-term, stable employment in payroll with the same company, and I'm very excited about the opportunity this role presents. I believe your standards are a match for my own and I would quickly become a positive contributor to your payroll team. That is another very strong answer to help you pass your payroll interview. Here's another question. How would you deal with an irate employee? Now, this payroll interview question is assessing your communication and interpersonal skills. Are you able to deal with challenging situations with confidence to achieve a successful outcome? So here's my example answer to help you. How would you deal with an irate employee? Here we go. I would remain calm. I would listen to their concerns and I would use effective listening and communication skills to diffuse a situation with a view to getting to the bottom of their problem quickly. So whenever you are dealing with an irate person, you must remember not to take things personally and you must maintain a calm and professional approach at all times. So I would ask some relevant questions to establish the exact problem and I would then seek to quickly provide a positive resolution. Now, working in payroll, it is likely that you will encounter frustrated employees, especially in respect of pay and tax. Therefore, it is so important to ensure the work you do is both on time and accurate. Now, at all times, I would aim to provide a high level of service within the payroll team, and I would carry out my duties to exacting standards in line with the company payroll policies and procedures. Another really strong answer that's going to help you to pass your interview. Now, the next thing to do is please make sure you click that link right now in the top right hand corner of the video. It will take you through to my website, passmyinterview.com, and you can download my full set of 23 payroll interview questions and top scoring answers, including the ones we have just worked through together today during this presentation. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can also connect with me on LinkedIn. I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below the video. And please give the video a thumbs up because that motivates me to create more content for you. Thank you for watching and I wish you all the best for passing your payroll interview. Have a brilliant day.